The story thus far has been one in which we're seeing the US dollar sell off a bit into the second quarter, but the selling has been mild thus far, and it really comes down to which narrative is going to have more of an influence on financial markets in the weeks and months ahead. If it's ongoing US stimulus and a Fed that refuses to budge, then we should expect more dollar selling and a continued record run in US stocks. If on the other hand, we start hearing more about rising U.S. bond yields. This could easily more than offset the stimulus theme and translate to renewed dollar demand and risk off flow. We think it's going to be a lot about this going forward. And whichever way the balance shifts relating to these narratives will be how we can expect markets to react. Today's calendar features PMI reads out of the Eurozone, Germany and UK, U.S. trade data, Fed speak and the Fed minutes late in the day. That's all for now.